back here with the new host of After Midnight, Taylor Tomlinson. I am I'm very excited about uh, After Midnight, and I and I I cannot wait for the first episode. Again, it's going to be a week from tomorrow. Yes. At uh, twelve thirty-seven or some weird time they put us on next week. Uh, could you give me an example of what might be happening on the show? An example of the games that might be played based upon what's happening on the internet? Yes, of course. So we have a game we brought today. We thought it'd be fun called Ick or No Ick. Stephen, I know you've been happily married for. 50 million years. Do you know what an ick is? The only ick I know is a disease that your fish can get in a freshwater tank. So close. Um, okay, so ick is a term introduced by the internet where you suddenly get turned off by the person you're dating, by Got what it. they're wearing or sure. say or dress. It mostly sure. women. A deal breaker. Yeah, a deal breaker, exactly. Mostly women experience this because we have standards, unfortunately. Um, <laughs> But some of these you might not even think of. Like, for example, no-show socks. Okay. Take a look. You look so dumb right now. See, now that's an ick. Socks should be seen and not heard. I get it. I understand the You get it. Understand you understand? Premise, yes. Okay, so you want to play a quick I'm round? I'm ready to play a quick round. Of ick or no ick. Many people are saying it's the new balderdash. Steven, I'm going to give you a quirk, and you tell me if it is an ick or no ick. Are you ready, Dr. Colbert? I'm ready. I was told to call you that. First up, clapping when an airplane lands. Ick or no ick? Um, uh, right now, if someone lands a plane with all the parts it took off with... <laughs> standing ovation. I, I say no, I say no ick. Okay, I mean, that's a this week specific answer, but the overall answer is... It's an ick, okay? Landing the plane is not a performance. Landing the plane is the bare minimum. All okay, right? I get it. Okay, you get it? I get All it, All right, yeah. not a strong start, but we're, we're getting into it. <laughs> Next up, Instagram account for your pet. Ick or no ick? Uh, okay. Okay, Instagram for your pet. All right, if you're one of those people <laughs> who goes to, like, the park with, like, an iguana or, like, a cockatiel on your shoulder right. just waiting for us to ask, what kind of pet is that? We're never going to ask. We know what you're doing. Just go home and put it on Instagram. <laughs> I would say Instagram for pet is no ick. All right. The answer is ick. <laughs> Social media is toxic. Steven, do you want to give your dog body dysmorphia? <laughs> They're already captives. OK, two for two. Not going great. <laughs> All right. What about okay. this one? We'll give you another so shot. I'm two zip. OK. Yeah, got, two got zip it. so far. Yep. Uh, that's OK. You already have a show. Um, <laughs> So do you, <laughs> for now. <laughs> All right, keep going. All right. All right, what about this one? Being an only child, ick or no ick? Uh, well, I'm one of 11, uh, uh, so I don't necessarily know. I would say probably no ick, because then you only have to imagine your parents doing it once. Have you imagined your parents doing it 11 times? Keep going. Okay. Just keep going. Oh, no, it's okay. All right. Just keep, just keep, Sorry. Just keep going. Yeah, yeah, no. You're, keep going. That's, keep between, going. that's between you and your God. Um, <laughs> anyway, the answer is absolutely an <laughs> ick, all right? Have you ever met someone who thinks all of their ideas are good? Yeah, it's because they didn't have siblings to beat it out of them. You need feedback at home. Okay. All right, are you ready for our final round? Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> Okay. okay. Uh -huh. No, I think you'll like this one. Okay. Knowing too much about Lord of the Rings. <laughs> ick or no ick? Well, based on my high school dating in, in, in history, I'm gonna say ick. <laughs> the answer is, Stephen, no ick. <laughs> Lord of the Rings is a classic. Plus, men who love Tolkien make great decisions about hiring and producing, and they're always giving women opportunities. <laughs> Well, you are the Galadriel of late night. <laughs> Taylor Tomlinson, thank you so much thank for being so here. Much. After Midnight premieres next Tuesday on CBS After the Late Show. Taylor Tomlinson, we'll be right back.